If you come back in 10 years, this fallen tree will almost be completely gone and turned back to soil. This process is key to life on Earth and is the result of some amazing organisms called fungi. Welcome to Moving Math and Science. The kingdom fungi is made up of mushrooms, molds, yeast, and even bread mold. Fungi are very important to life on Earth because they are major decomposers and help recycle nutrients back to the Earth. Life on Earth would be very different without the decomposing and recycling abilities of fungi. Here are some basic facts. Fungi are eukaryotic, which means they have a nucleus and membrane-bound organelles. They are heterotrophs and get their energy from other organisms instead of the sun. However, instead of eating their food, they absorb their nutrition by secreting powerful enzymes that break down living and non-living organisms. Most are multicellular, but some like yeast are unicellular. Fungi contain a cell wall made of chitin. Fungi contain hyphae, which are tubular filaments. These filaments create an interwoven mass called a mycelium. When you see a mushroom, you can be sure there are lots of mycelium underneath it in the soil. Fun fact, the largest organism on Earth is a mushroom. The hyphae of this mushroom found in Washington State covers 2.5 square miles. Now that's a big organism. Fungi may look like plants, but they are not plants, and they're different in several ways. Fungi do not have chlorophyll, so they cannot practice photosynthesis. They reproduce with spores and not seeds, and they have cell walls made of chitin instead of cellulose, like plants do. Fungi break down matter and absorb nutrients using a network of fibers called hyphae. This can happen with living organisms, like when you get athlete's foot, or with dead organisms, which are broken down by wood decaying fungi. Hyphae are tube-like structures that grow and cover a food source and then secrete enzymes, which allows them to digest and absorb nutrients. Many fungi, like mushrooms, has a, have a visible fruit which is easily seen, and then, like I've said, hyphae uh, underneath in a mass called a mycelium, and it's mostly hidden from view. Fungi come in many different shapes and sizes. Some examples are mushrooms, sac fungi, bread mold, yeast, the strange-looking slime molds, stink horns, that's a great name, toadstools, just to name a few. And finally, fun fact, fungi are the only organisms that can break down the tough material found in trees. Without fungi, all the trees that have died would still be around. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.